Carol Manukin of the Buffalo Niagara Vein Treatment Centers discussing perforator veins and perforator venous reflux. Perforator veins allow communication between the superficial venous system and deep venous system of the legs. Superficial veins include the great saphenous vein and its branches and the lesser or short saphenous vein and its branches as well as other non-named superficial veins of the legs. The deep veins of the legs include the common femoral vein, the femoral vein, the popliteal vein, the anterior tibial vein, the posterior tibial vein, and perfect perineal veins, among others. This is an animation showing the normal perforator vein. In light blue is blood flowing in the superficial veins, for example, the great saphenous vein. Notice that the blood flow is from right to left going upwards towards the heart, but blood does not dip down through the perforator vein into the deeper vein which is shown in darker blue. Next animation shows The next animation shows perforator vein reflux. Again in the light blue is the superficial veins and the deep vein is shown in dark blue. The red is the calf muscle. In this case you can see blood from the deep veins going into the superficial vein or feeding the tributaries of the superficial veins. As such blood from the deep veins gets into the superficial veins underneath the skin and this is an abnormal physiology. This type of perforator vein reflux can be treated and special endovenous laser therapy can be used to put a needle through which a small microfiber laser is placed into that perforator vein and that perforator vein can be eliminated. As such there's two parallel circulations which do not do not communicate with each other. Perforator vein EVLT technology is only available at the vein treatment center and special EVLT catheters using the never touch technique are used. Patients can return to work immediately after the procedure and resume all exercises within 30 minutes of the procedure including running, jogging, bicycling, using the treadmill and elliptical, doing yoga and other activities. This is Dr. Karmanukian from the Buffalo Niagara Vein Treatment Centers discussing perforator vein physiology. You can contact us by calling 716-839-3638 or going to www.veinsveinsveins.com and www.peacebridgehealthcare.com. Canadian patients are welcome at our facilities. Thank you.